the stage next. Give it up for Darwin Barcelano. Sorry, I'm late. I've always wanted to stand up. I'm still trying to learn how to stand up. I know what you're all thinking. And I'm gonna tell you this. Yes. If you're wondering why I walk this way, I'll tell you. I was stabbed multiple times still in my mother's womb by my dad's penis. <laughs> <laughs> you see, you see right there, right there. <laughs> when I was old enough, I took my cane and knocked it on his head. I said, Dad, how do you like it? Tuk, 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 tuk. <laughs> I remember walking down the street with my brother and my three cousins. We lived in a rough neighborhood. All of a sudden, one of them says, hey, let's all walk like Darwin. We can't get abducted because no one wants to kidnap disabled kids. <laughs> kids are so mean. As a kid, I put on my dad's speed stick, thinking it would make me more speedy. I'm still waiting for it to work. As a kid, my favorite movie or show was uh, Night Rider with David Hasselhoff. But I didn't call it Night Rider, guess what I called it? T. Dean. T E E D A N. I'll explain. You're, you're all confused, right? I called it because of the theme song. <laughs> That's it. So. I bought my first vehicle with my parents. That was very interesting. My dad was sitting in front of the salesman with his arm crossed. No, nothing said. My mom to his side. All of a sudden, my mom reaches over the desk, holds the salesman's hand ever so like, gently, starts caressing it. <laughs> and then I looked at my dad. I'm like, are you going to do anything? Sits back, crosses his arms, and nods like... I can hear some music playing in the background, like... Hungry eyes I feel the magic between you and I Like, where did you guys learn how to do this? At the end, we ended up getting $500 off my vehicle. But that wasn't enough for my dad. He leans over to me and goes, Hey, Darwin. Stand up, walk around. Maybe you'll feel jealous. Maybe put a free car starter. <laughs> I seen a photo of my parents, all young and skinny. I said, Dad, what's your trick? How do you stay, how do you stay so fit and, 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 and slim? This is how my dad talks. He always talks like this. He starts like he's like inflating a tire. He goes, or smoking something, I don't know. <laughs> you know, son, there is no trick. We had no food. We weren't dieting, we were dying. You're not just a dentist in the Philippines, actually. You're the hygienist, you're the uh, orthodontist, and actually you're, you're the person that does circumcisions as well. <laughs> no, 
no, no, no, no, no lie. Just make sure they start from the top to the bottom. Why is your dentist prick stick as uh, salt? Why is there this uh, calamari stock on it? What's this? My wife fell in love with me right away. I thought it was for my looks, my charm. And I asked her, and she says, no, it's for my parking spot. <laughs> she always compares me to her two-year-old son. Look at this, he's, he's handsome, dresses better than you, looks better than you. He has a bigger penis than you. He's only two. I'm teaching my son colors right now. And uh, we're learning his basic colors. So we say red, he goes raz. We say green, he goes uni. I say orange, he goes trump. <laughs> I bought like 23 boxes of Krispy Kreme at the office the other day. Sent out a mass email. Came back, all that was left was napkins, half eaten donut, and just a dust cloud, like those cartoons when they just disappear. <laughs> I recently checked out the Ripley's Believe It or Not exhibit, World's Tallest Man. He was eight feet tall, 11 inches. I stood beside him, I was as tall as his left testicle. <laughs> Gives a whole new meaning to, I can see where he's coming from. <laughs> My grandma, I think, I, I think that's where I get all my inappropriateness from. She has no filter. My cousin asked her, Grandma, when you get older, do your pubics turn white as well? She doesn't say anything. I guess they come runs in her family. They don't say anything. They should do. She lifts up her duster, pulls down her jogging pants and her panties in one swipe, and she goes, Check out these 50 shades of gray. That's my time. My name is Darwin. Thanks for having me.